My first, like, real relationship, I would write little poems and letters that were sappy and dramatic. But I don't know, it was important to me. The idea that you could be feeling sad or lonely, and you could go look at that carefully thought out message with all this weight and passion behind it and think to yourself, once upon a time, someone somewhere felt this way about me. My partner at the time <laughs> hated it. She thought it was so stupid, so I, uh, well, so I stopped. selfish on my part. Like, they thought what I wrote was funny or childish, but I would mean every word, and I so desperately wanted that same effort back. And they were going to, but just ultimately couldn't be bothered. I guess they felt comfortable. Like, like you'd go to the ends of the earth where there's no grass at all for just about anyone else. But when it came to me, it wasn't necessary. I... Hmm... You already knew. I made sure you knew. And maybe that was just my mistake. I started to realize that's the curse of the artist. You're not someone that anyone would write poetry about. It seems like no person or thing could ever contain that obsession, even if they tried. And at this point, if I'm a subject of interest, it's to me. You could let people in every aspect of yourself and view your every vulnerability, but they still don't really know you at all. They still try to put you into a box that's easy to digest and disallows the nuance that's so vital to every emotion you feel. You don't need emotion. Just sing. I get all of my connection through communication, ever-reaching, dramatic, and passionate, and I think I feel awful enough now. So to conclude, I was, I am, and always will be my own muse.